Junkyard Junkie, back here with another video. Do you have a 12th gen Ford F-150 that you want to retain your backup camera and microphone whenever you're installing a new radio? Well, today I'll show you exactly how you can do that. Okay, so there's going to be two things you're going to need, and I'll put the links in the description. The one is this right here. This retains your regular microphone. Then this one is like an in-between for the reverse camera up in the mirror. With this, the reverse mirror will still work even with the new radio. So let's jump right into it. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is take a little pry tool and pry that out. Then we're gonna come back here and you're just gonna grab on right there and pull down. This will give us access to our headliner bolt that will be right here. We'll also have one here. We'll actually have two here. So one, two, these are Phillips head. This will make it easier to run the wires. So we'll just take our little pry tool, get back behind here, just pry it out like that. Okay, now we're gonna pry this out right here. So we'll just try to get behind it. Just like that. Okay, so you just want to unplug these two. That way you can sit this thing to the side. So just press in, pull out, press in, pull out. Okay, so for this part, you just want to get you a Phillips head screwdriver. We're just going to take these out real quick. There's one on the right side. And then there's going to be two right here on this left side. For this last one, we'll have to fold it up and get into it right here. Let that hang there. Okay, so the next thing we want to do is remove this A pillar. If you have tweeters on your A-pillar, like this right here, you just want to come down here, take this off, so just pull, pull it out. And then this is usually in a better spot. You'll see a green and red wire, and you'll just unplug that. That way it can come out with the A-pillar. Okay, so to remove the A-frame, you just want to take it, just pop it out like that. This is why you had to undo your tweeter because that has to come out with it. Okay, so if we look up in here, the wire connects right down here. It's too hard to show, but you just undo it right there. That's where the new one will plug up to. Okay, so then once you get it unplugged, you just wanna pull it right out. Okay, so looking at our new one, pretty much looks like the old one. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this and put it in the housing of the new one, and then this will run down to our radio. So let's do that now. Okay, so we have our housing right here. We're gonna reuse it. Just come back here with a little screwdriver. You're just gonna pop this out, just like that. Now we can put the other one in. Okay, so with our new wire, we want the side with the tape to go inwards, so the solid piece will be outwards. And all we're gonna do is just stick it right back in there where it was. Quick little note, as you can see here, this is actually 3D printed. But now we'll just stick it back in there where it was. Fits right in there snugly, just like that. Okay, so now we're just gonna shove our wire right back in. And with our wire in there, we can also go ahead and reattach this. Okay, so I did get it back in there. You wanna have one tab facing outwards and just kinda push it in. The other one you're going to push like straight back so it can go in and then just come from the back and press it down. But now we can grab our headliner and pull down and grab our wire. Okay, so you just want to reach back there, get your wire, 
And we're gonna go ahead and pull it all the way out just because I want to make sure that I have it. So there we go, we have it out. Now then we're going to run it over to here and then we're going to tuck this up in here. But since we're doing the reverse wire, we're also going to make sure we go on the right side of this and we're going to get our reverse wire on there before we start buttoning everything back up. So just keep stuffing it in there. Okay, so we have our little connector right here that we're going to unplug and plug our new one into. And then it goes up and comes around to right here. This is where it plugged into the upper console right here. Okay, so this will be ran down to your new radio. And this will pretty much intercept the feed in between your wire. And I'll show you that now. So what you want to do is unplug it here. So just press in, pull out. Now with your new connector, you're going to clip it in. On the other side of the connector, we'll plug right back in where you had the other one. Just like that. Okay, so now we'll just tuck all this up here to the side. Give it that nice clean look. We'll run our little video wire down through here. Just stuffing it in. Just like that. Okay, so we just want to get this back up in here. This side just kind of want those wires go back up in there like they were just feed them up there like that now then we should be able to get it lined back up go crazy with them or else you'll strip them and then you're in for a bad day okay so now we'll just make sure this last one gets in there get it nice and snug perfect now we just want to put this upper center piece right back in here so you just line it up Just like that. Okay, so once you got those plugged up, we'll just stick it right back up in here. There should be some tabs that it locks into, just like that. All right, now we're good to go. Okay, so now we're just gonna take both of our lines and stick it through up here so it's tucked behind the A pillar. And as they come down through here, we'll catch them. Okay, so now we're just going to stuff these in here. And we will route them over and under anything that we need. That way we can get it to the radio. I'm not installing the radio just yet. So for now, I'll be leaving it like this until I am ready to install my radio. Okay, so now you just want to take your tweeter wire, stick it through. Now you can line up your A pillar and that's all there is to it. If you found this video helpful, please leave me a like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you.